everyone. I'm number 11. I'd like to read you story number 8. Why ants are found everywhere. One day, Lion, the king of the beasts, ordered all the other animals to honor him. One by one, tiger, elephant, snake, and many other animals came to bow before Lion. Even Ant set out on the journey. It was a long and tough trip for a tiny creature like Ant. As a result, Ant was the last to arrive. When the animals saw Ant coming, they made fun of him. Lion roared with laughter and said, It's about time you got here. Ant crawled away in shame. He told the queen of the ants how badly Lion had treated him. The ant queen was angry. She asked her friend Worm to crawl into Lion's ear and make him uncomfortable. Worm crept into Lion's ear. He twisted and turned. He wiggled and jiggled. Lion roared. He shook his head back and forth trying to get Worm out. The other animals offered help, but nobody was small enough. Lion knew he would go crazy if he didn't find a way to get rid of Worm. At last, he realized there was only one animal that could help him. Lion asked Ant Queen for help. The Ant Queen thought Lion had been punished enough, so she sent Ant to help. When Ant finally arrived, Lion was rolling on the ground in pain. Ant crawled into Lion's ear and called out, Thank you, Worm. You can come out now. Lion was so relieved that he rewarded Ant. He said, Well done, Ant. I have decided that from now on, you and your all the other ants may live anywhere you like. And that is why, to this day, even though many animals can live only in the jungle, some only in the desert, and others only in the rainforest, ants live